My name is Devin Columbus. I am 30 years old. I live in Victoria, BC, and I decided to get Invisalign by Dr. Suzuki. I had some, uh, I have some crowding in my bottom teeth. I call it Jim Carrey teeth because Jim Carrey and I have very similar bottom teeth. Um, so, you know, eating and it, my bite is a little off. My top teeth, the, the two front teeth actually have been kind of increasingly going back over the years and a bit of a snaggle tooth. So I wanted to get rid of that. Um, and I, I was actually quite uh, skeptical about my bottom teeth. But when I met with Dr. Suzuki, he assured me that it wasn't a problem. And uh, so here I am. Um, sore, sore. The first tray, uh, the very next day, I felt extremely sore. In fact, to the touch. And I remember I was eating a piece of toast and I felt like my teeth were gonna fall out. That's how sore. They were like bruise, like if, if you had a bruise on your, in your arm, that's what my teeth were feeling like. And uh, into tray two, and three, uh, they started to kind of uh, get used to the foreign object and as uh, the different trays fit on, they're less sore than the very beginning, but the very beginning is quite shocking uh, and it, it just felt so weird and uh, pretty uncomfortable. Eating is, uh, it's been interesting. Uh, it, it's the weirdest thing in the world to have to think about taking something out of your mouth to eat uh, and even drinking. In fact, uh, I went to see uh, the NFC Finals game in Seattle and I went with a bunch of boys and all of us were just having a, a guy's weekend but I had these Invisalign so not only did I have a bit, bit of a list but I had to eat and drink beer and stuff the whole weekend with these things and I got constantly razzed. But the funniest was when I was at IHOP and I'm at the table taking out my, my trays. It was super embarrassing and I had to go brush my teeth in an IHOP bathroom, which I don't think many people get a chance to do. Yeah, so in public, I constantly feel like people are judging me right now anyway. Uh, I feel like they're constantly looking at my Invisalign, which is ridiculous because they're practically invisible. I mean, if you know what you're looking for, I'm sure you can tell that I have them on, but um, it, it's been a bit of a concern. Otherwise, it's, you know, you can hear it when I say, say, or this. I have a bit of a, bit of a tongue issue with my trays, uh, but I, I get over it. Uh, I would say my tongue, uh, depending on the tray, so the first tray was obviously the most difficult. The second tray was a bit better, but my tongue is constantly feeling it. It's constantly trying to touch this foreign object in my mouth. So that's kind of difficult because then when I'm eating food that has, like for example, BLT is my worst enemy because of the toasted bread. And if I forget to ask for lightly toasted, my tongue just feels like it's been ripped apart. Also, what's, what's kind of interesting is, you know, we have these um, chewies, Dr. Suzuki calls them. Uh, this thing is meant to, when you put your tray back in, you have to, you know, chew on it as hard and, and, and as constant as possible to make sure that the tray gets seated back onto your teeth. So that can be a bit challenging. I, I forget to do that a lot. And probably my wife's favorite is me constantly going like this. So it looks like I'm angry. And I'm not angry. I'm just feeling these things in my mouth. And I'm trying to seat them back onto my teeth. So I don't know if you call it a challenge. But it's definitely something I'm not used to. And um, again, I'll get over that too. Uh, there, there's, 
definitely been changes. In fact, the very uh, first week I noticed, uh, I have this one tooth right there that sticks up above all the others in my bottom row. And I have noticed it just, you know, ever so slightly start turning uh, because of the way the, you know, the trades have been put together. So uh, other than them being sore, obviously that means that they're moving. Into the second tray, uh, I definitely felt and saw a bit of a difference when it came to uh, my bottom teeth. Top teeth, not so much. I uh, haven't seen much, but you know, it, the, the changes aren't so drastic. For my top teeth, I'm assuming. Um, but uh, I'm definitely seeing progress, so I guess the uncomfortableness is, is worth it at this point.